love the dog, hate the smell, check out the Vishla. That's right, they don't have an odor. They're very clean dogs. They, they don't have that doggy smell. These self-cleaning dogs even lick themselves like a cat. No wonder Vishlas have been the quintessential royal dog for centuries. Smooth and handsome, regal and statuesque. Vishlas are the aristocrats of the dog world. The Vishla is a gorgeous dog. Face it, these dogs look like they belong. They're just a majestic looking dog. They're just beautiful and uh, stunning. With their smooth coat, lean figure, and almost prancing-like gait, they can sometimes look more like a well-placed prop than a real live dog. It's okay. But don't let this fool you. These pups okay. have pep. You have to get them exercised about two hours a day, and I mean running exercise. This is not a walk around the block kind of dog. Vishlas want to run, not walk. And good at running they are. Their ancestors, the Magyar Vishlas, were the choice hunting dogs back in the Austro-Hungarian Empire. As part retriever and part pointer, they were bred with a keen sense of smell and incredible sense of motivation. Those dogs became the crown jewel of Hungary. Only the creme de la creme owned them. But as the empire fell apart, they were crossed with the Weimaraner and the German short-haired pointer, resulting in the sleek hunter we have today. The flip side of this energetic pup is a dog that loves to relax with you. When not running, it's hard to find a Vishla anywhere else but at your feet. Vizelas are very affectionate dogs. They're also known as the Velcro dog because they like to stay with you. Unless you're throwing a ball, expect a Vishla to be on your lap. Good boy. For the dog that seems to be half cat already, check out their paws. With long toes and small compact pads, their paws are classified as cat-like. If not for the nails on hardwood floors, you would never know they were coming. Another trait that allows them to go unnoticed by prey, their eyes. Bred to show no white, the brown irises blend right into the Vishla's coat. Vishla's are possibly the ultimate camo dog. Their coat is the color of cinnamon, from head to tail, with virtually no variation. Vishla's are an active dog. They are not great for city living, but thrive in the open country. There may not be an easier dog to groom. They're just very clean. They have very short coat. They smell good all the time. If you run a dry cloth over them a couple of times a week, they'll only need a bath four or five times a year. Like most active dogs, they're prone to hip dysplasia, but this is less so with Vishlas. Overall, don't worry about spending a lot at the vet with these pups. Vishlas need training. Vishlas are trainable uh, with somebody that knows what they're doing. Sit. Good boy. You need to train them slowly and carefully because they can kind of become overwhelmed if you give them too much to think about at once. Down. Because they want to work for Down. you, you need to be patient in training them. It takes some time to focus all their energy in the right direction. No doubt the Vishla is a lovable family dog, but this breed has a ton of energy, so it's best to be careful around small kids. Probably it's going to do best in the family that does a lot of outdoor activities. Not necessarily great with real young children. While best in big open areas, they're one of the healthiest dogs and one of the easiest to groom. Put all your time into their training, it'll pay off. And they do need attention around small kids. Equally comfortable on the couch next to you and in the woods playing fetch, Vishlas will keep you in great company and on your toes. Let's go get it. 